All right, fellas, what's up? It's your boy Hutch back again with another video. In today's video, we're gonna be going over a Super Saiyan push day workout, all right? We're gonna be hitting the shoulders, chest, triceps. Now, growing up as a kid, I was a big fan of Dragon Ball Z. I swear, I've seen like every single episode at least like three times. One episode that touched me the most was when Goku turned Super Saiyan for the first time. I mean, that shit is epic. And like, I remember like being in my living room like, Ah, like, like trying to turn like Super Saiyan and stuff like that, and never can do it. But when I discovered calisthenics, that's when I finally was able to turn Super Saiyan. You feel me? And now I want to spread that knowledge to y'all. Now I want y'all to get Super Saiyan as well. So without further ado, let's get into the work. All right. So if any of y'all have ever seen Dragon Ball Z. Y'all know how jacked Goku looks, especially in Super Saiyan form, right? Like, I mean, like, chest popping, shoulders popping. I mean, like, everything is, like, popping in his physique. Obviously, one muscle that sticks out in particular is his chest. I mean, Goku's chest is, like, ridiculous. I mean, hella definition, size, everything, right? Now, one piece of equipment that we're going to use to get to that Super Saiyan level is gymnastic rings. So to complete these exercises, make sure you have a pair of gymnastic rings. I'm telling you, it's gonna get you right. First workout that we're gonna do to develop that Super Saiyan chest is the ring dip. All right, now I love this workout. It's a fantastic workout for developing your chest, shoulders, and triceps, not to mention I ain't gonna lie, it looks sexy as hell doing ring dips. And because it hits the muscle so good isometrically, that puts more tension on the muscle, thus leading to more development. Now, I understand if this exercise is too difficult, there is a regression that you can do. I got you. That exercise is the bar dip. Very similar to the ring dip, however, it takes away the balancing aspect and you can just focus on the concentric and eccentric portion of the movement. So focus on the bar dip and then work your way up to the ring dip. All right, so other than Goku's chest, obviously my man's shoulders is popping out of control. So another workout that we're gonna do to get that Super Saiyan shoulders is handstand pushups. Do these, you wanna just put your body up against the wall, stomach facing the wall, and go down and push back up. It's pretty similar to doing a barbell shoulder press, except you're just pressing up your body. And let me tell you, this exercise will get you them nice, sexy 3D shoulders that you want. Now, I understand this exercise may be too tough. So just like a lot of other calisthenic exercises, there is a regression you can do. The regression is the pipe push-up. Now the pipe push, pipe push up ain't Super Saiyan level, but it's a solid base form exercise to do to get you to that Super Saiyan level. Just continue doing these until you can work your way up to doing handstand push ups. Hold on, before we get into the next exercise, have you hit that subscribe button yet? Do you hit the like button? I'm gonna need you to hit both, or I'm gonna go Super Saiyan on your ass and hit you with that command <laughs> anyway, for real. Hit that like, hit that subscribe right now, turn on notifications, for real, I ain't playing. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking, but for real though. It, it, that, that does go a long way, so I would greatly appreciate it if you did. Now, sticking with the shoulders and the chest, the next exercise we got is the Pelican Push-Up. And oh lord, this exercise is like Super Saiyan God tier level if you can do it. You literally putting your arms behind you and pushing up. When by doing so, you get a much deeper range of motion. And doing it on a box puts you on an elevated surface, thus putting more tension on your shoulders and your chest. You can't quite do these. You can do ring push-ups. All 
Ring push-ups is just your basic base form push-up with the wrench. And by doing this exercise, you can work your way up to get into those Pelican push-ups one day. Exercise numero cuatro is the plant push-up. Now there's many different variations of the plant push-up, but the Super Saiyan plant push-up is doing it with your legs off the floor. As you can see, I'm using a band to help assist me. It's basically like you like flying. That's what Super Saiyans do. Super Saiyans fly. So if you wanna be a Super Saiyan, you gotta practice this movement. Now, if it's too tough for you, you can do plants push-ups on the ground. And it's very similar to doing a push-up, except you're gonna make sure you lean as far as you can to the point where your arms are beside your hips and you're gonna just go down and push back up and maintain that lean as you push back up. All right, last but not least, exercise number five, incline bench press. Perfect. What you really wanna focus on with these is getting that full range of motion and keeping your elbows in throughout the entire movement. And I'm telling you, after you know about a few months of doing these, you're gonna see them gains in that chest. And you're gonna be looking closer to Goku than you think. If you can complete all these exercises, then you have achieved Super Saiyan level strength. And you have joined an elite class of warriors aka body weight beats. All right, so those are all the workouts. Go ahead, give them a shot. If you have any questions, leave a comment in the section down below. Also, you already know, hit the like, subscribe, turn on notifications, that way you don't miss any more of these banger videos. Also, follow my IG because I post content on there as well. All right, all right, that's all I got for y'all fellas. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next vid. Peace out.